Thousands of Twin Cities families started distance learning today. Minneapolis Public Schools is one of the districts that's been on spring break. The superintendent said the district is making sure students who don't have access to technology won't fall behind. They'll eventually get iPads or Chromebooks for students, but in the meantime, there is a plan in place. And if students are not able to utilize technology, uh, then we have uh, paper packets that are being developed. Uh, staff have been working over the last several weeks to, to develop those, make copies of them, uh, coordinate the distribution of them. Um, you know, so that's been a huge undertaking. Students and staff have access to a mental health hotline that has already been up and running. Students will also be able to contact their teachers for help on any assignments. St. Paul Public Schools also began distance learning today. Superintendent Joe Gothard told us there are a lot of things to keep in mind when asking students to learn from home. It's important to us that we're finding that balance, uh, that we're engaging our students, we're connecting with our students. And we have to remember, uh, you know, we're watching the news this morning to something that's happening in the world that we've never seen before in our lifetime as well. So the social, emotional well-being of our students and our families is also of critical importance. The soonest students could go back into the classroom is May 5th, but you'll remember last week Governor Wall said it was, quote, very unlikely schools would resume this school year across the state.